fellow RVers, this is Kat from Class C RV Lady. I just wanted to show you my sofa. So, I made myself a sofa. Okay, I didn't actually make it myself, I just covered it. Um, and I added a pad for seating. And so, I didn't really need the dinette. I needed space, um, opposed to dinette space. So, um, I already showed you the video where I made the table. Um, I'm going to put a little um, noodle thing <laughs> over that just so that, you know, the dogs don't hurt themselves when we're driving. And, yeah, there we go. So there's my corner, and the rest of the spots are for the dogs to fight over. Um, I'm going to put down um, some blankets just because uh, I made these some time ago. Um, might even have a video up on that, but... Um, uh, or I made it, I think, before I started this channel. Um, and, yeah, of course, you know, we've been camping since October, so um, it, it, they needed to be washed. It smelled a lot like dog in here. So um, I washed them. Uh, they shrunk, of course, because I did not pre-wash. And, um, yeah, not the best fabric. It's heavy-duty fabric, but it does not like to be washed. It frays like crazy. Matter of fact, this piece here, I had to um, actually re-sew it, and that's why now it's not perfect, and it's too small because I lost about uh, half an inch. So I'm going to come up with something different. I'm going to see if that thing will fit maybe in a pillowcase, or I'll have to make something else. Just try and find the color that will work with these. Um, just because this is just um, a piece of foam. So, um, yeah. So I'm happy with this. It's quite comfortable to sit and recline and watch the old TV. Although, you know, when I'm camping, I honestly, if I don't watch a movie, I don't even bother. Um, I'd much rather just be on my computer. So, yeah, we'll see. We'll see if I even keep the TV. Except for it is kind of nice to watch a movie up there. Anyway, alright, so this is a real fast video. So this is what I did. I made covers out of um, outdoor furniture fabric. Uh, it's real he uh, It's like a duck duck cloth, I think. Um, it's real heavy. Let's see if you can see that. It's real heavy. So um, it'll hold up to wear and tear as long as my seams don't give out. So I'm not going to wash it very often. But um, I do have to wash it on occasion. <laughs> All right. Thanks for stopping by. Remember, give me a thumbs up. So like, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching. See you again soon. Bye. Back really quick to put a little proper end to this video. Um, I went ahead and fixed this cushion, which I mentioned needed some help. So what I did was I basically took the uh, the side pleats out and then I just sewed on a another fabric sort of the same quality a little a little nicer um, and then I just closed it or did I close it no I didn't close it <laughs> sorry dropped it uh, I just put some pins uh, safety pins so um, that works nobody's gonna get hurt with those they go in the back I also covered the um, just from some scraps, I covered the extra piece of foam. Um, I don't know, just because. <laughs> so, yeah. All right, let me put this back. Nope, that's not the right way. This way. Sorry. All right, so I also um, sewed these edges. And I wanted to show you how I solved the problem. Of getting this to close so I didn't sew this side because I want to be able to take this out but I installed snaps oops sorry see snaps um, having my own business previously where I make you know lanyards and key rings and whatnot um, baby bibs and stuff I used to have an Etsy business that did quite well but um, got too busy so, um, anyway, I have all the stuff that I haven't gotten rid of yet, so probably won't now. 
I'm finding uses for it. So there we go. All right. Let me um, put this back. Okay, so, and I told you that I was going to cover this. Um, this will be a winter cover. I will probably just put um, a sheet. I'll get, like, two probably crib size sheets and uh, cover this in the summer to just keep it, you know, a little cleaner. Or if I get a twin size, I'll double it. All right, thanks once again for sticking around to the end. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. And if you'd like, um, go check out uh, my Patreon page. There's a link below in the description. And um, there I am putting little little videos. Uh, I've just started it. I mean, like literally just started it. So it's, it doesn't have much. But um, I will eventually get it up so that it will definitely be worth your while to um, maybe leave me a tip. Okay? All right. Thanks so much. Ta-ta for now.